Hi guys. So, I was trying to think of videos to make, and my lovely, lovely friend Karen Y gave me some ideas. Um, she said favorites. Um, favorite hooks, favorite yarns, favorite whatevers. So today I thought I would show you some of my favorite hooks. Um, I never really thought about what my favorite hooks were. And so I actually, I may be a yarn or a hook hoarder. Um, let me show you. Let's see if I can do this. Please don't get sick. These are just my sets. Can you see them? In cases. Okay. Yeah. They're not all in there because some are in whips. This, oh, and if you're wondering, this lovely little box came from Lowe's. Yes, I love I love my containers. I have found M Marie Kondo this year. I love her. She would probably hate me, but I love her. And I'm going to follow her system once I actually can organize my room. I, I have nowhere to put anything right now, but... Okay, so this... These are all of my um, aluminum hooks and uh, miscellaneous and they are organized see eye hooks now the reason I kept them yeah I know who needs all those eye hooks I want to do sculpey handles on them I mean I, I want to play I want to play. I also am, um, I just got acrylic resin. I'd never thought of doing acrylic resin handles, but I mean, wait. If you have it and you have these, why not try, right? I mean, I have, I also have the glitter. My family actually let me buy glitter. They took me and said, buy the glitter. I think they might have eaten some mushrooms. Just saying. They never let me have glitter. <laughs> so, <laughs> just, oh, and this one, I have not learned this yet, but I have the hooks. I have the hooks to learn it, and I have the long hooks. Tunisian. Tun I learned knitting. Okay, just saying. Does anybody ever do this? They smell, and I'm just saying, they came from there. Smell like China? When you buy something, and it comes from China, and it has that that smell and you have to let it sit out for like three weeks to aerate yeah okay but I love this bag you see my little bag it's my lucky kitty okay I, I do I need to let them aerate but I have a full set very smooth bamboo goes all the way up to what does it go up to 10 millimeter from small very long. I do, I've wanted to learn Tunisian. I've probably had those for five years and I have not learned yet. So I have Tunisian hooks. I have beautiful, beautiful light up hooks. But then I went and bought a neck light so I haven't used the light up hooks. I mean, I think I got these as a gift, but I always buy on sale. On sale. These are from Amazon. They are called Yarnis. Wait, there we go. Yarnis. If anybody wants. I bought 
with the wood grain looking handle. I have used them. They are very comfortable. They have three light. I don't know if it's still charged. We'll see. Nope. Dead as a doornail. But it has a USB charger. And nine hooks with a little tool to put it together. I kept the booklet. Of course. I have, oh, because my hands hurt. I have steel crochet hooks. See, I turned the camera around. I have steel crochet hooks with wooden handles so that if I ever want, I do enjoy using um, crochet thread, but I can't use the tiny, tiny handles of steel crochet hooks. So I got steel crochet hooks that have what you would call an ergonomic handle so that I can use the tiny, tiny hooks. These go from, what's the smallest one? 0.75 millimeters up to three millimeter. Okay, so those are my odd ones out. Now let me show you some of my favorites. I have in cases these are pretty pretty good if you enjoy boy hooks i have these sets they were selling them at walmart and they were reasonably priced i believe when i got them a couple years ago they were 18 dollars they came in this lovely kit and so i bought them um some are missing but i believe it's 10 crochet hooks from a K down to a D and they are boy but I believe they're um, taper they look taper they came with some darning needles and I believe they came with scissors which I of course lost um, they may have come with a ruler as well let me check the other one. Of course, missing the scissor and a darning needle and some, you know, some hooks. The hooks are in projects. I tend not to lose the hooks. They're just in projects. They are very smooth. I use both inline and, uh, uh, gosh, I forget what they are called. Inline and taper, I believe, are the two kinds. I use both kinds. I never actually knew there were different kinds until I started watching people say there were different kinds. So, uh, I never had a favorite kind. They are round, more rounded heads. But, um, good grip. Here, let me show you. Here you go. A good silicone grip. The numbers do not rub off very well or haven't for me yet. Nice pouch. I don't think Walmart has these pouches anymore. I think they give you a plastic, you know, it's just plastic and then the hooks are in them and then you get loose hooks. So I have two sets of those. I bought I bought this case, or we had it, I don't remember. I put in it, what did I put in it? It's another set of boy, or this is how it came, I don't remember. It's a set of boy. This one has one, two, three, four, 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 11 hooks up to an L. I may have put the L and the K and the J in it. I don't know. Memory. It goes from a B to an L in this case. I don't know what it originally did. Yeah, I think I may have added the bigger ones. Don't know. But, yeah. Apparently I like boy. I don't know. So we'll put that over there. These ones I got off of Amazon. And I love them so much. I got them on sale. 
no way did I pay full price. And as you can see, I'm using some of them. Tulip Edamo. Yeah, no way did I pay full price. Got them on deep, deep discount. These, I believe, are inline, pointy tip, gold. Yep. Love them. Very smooth, very quick to work with. I keep putting it off camera. I'm so sorry. I I flipped my tablet so the camera is over here now. And <laughs> I keep forgetting. But um, I do enjoy working with these. Yeah, I think I like the pointier tip. These go up to a J. They get started at a D. I think you get six or seven. You get scissors, a ruler, and a um, some darning needles. And you get the roll-up case, which is very nice. And um, I have two sets of those. I am very lucky when I find deals. And at the time, we had expendable cash. Um, we don't anymore, so I was very lucky to uh, find these when I did. Um, we are on fixed income pretty much, but we do have what we call a discretionary fund, so I am able to get things here and there. I'm just, I don't have a yarn. Like some people have yarn budgets, some people have hook budgets. I don't. I get birthday gifts, I get Christmas gifts. I have my biological dad who gives me money at Christmas and money at my birthday, and I use that to buy what I want. I did ask him for an interchangeable knitting needle set for my birthday this year instead of money. Um, we'll see. He usually, when I ask him for a gift, just gives me money instead, but I am thankful for everything I get. Um, I understand there are people who are way worse off than me, and... I am very thankful for everything I've ever received, and I try to help where I can, and yeah, but um, this, this one, box from the Dollar General, does everybody recognize these? I love these boxes, but um, these are something I've learned to love. I have won most of these. I guess I am very lucky in winning. We'll do this first. This is this was a crochet set that um, I got off of Amazon, and then I don't have the hooks anymore. But instead, I put in my wood furls. Now this is a breast cancer awareness one that I won, and it actually says. Who I want it from on it and it's Creation Crochet and she's a great designer and this is a J, J hook. This is also, this is an I hook and I think that's in, I don't know which color that's in, maybe the rosewood, but see what happened was it broke. It broke and they sent me a new one but they didn't make me send the old one back my dad fixed the broken one so now I have two and it works just fine and he sanded down where it was broken you can't even tell he is a master woodsman he is a master at everything but they did not make me send back so now I have two I ones is that cheating would you have fixed it if you could I mean and you wouldn't have thrown it away, would you? They didn't make me send it back. So those are my wood ones. I also won an alpha one. I actually have a little trouble using this one because it's so short. It's a K one. It's very pretty. That might, might be rosewood. So that might be um, ebony, the other one. But it's it's a little short. I, I, I'm a knife gripper. I might get used to it. So that's that one. That one was 
Oh, that one's supposed to be pink ivory. Anybody see pink there? Is that pink ivory? It was supposed to be a limited edition pink ivory. And they said sorry, but they did not replace it. Okay. So, let's all help me with this. This is a G hook. I do, I may not remember what these are. Oh, okay. So, this is the one that broke. My dad's going to try to fix this one too, but I don't know if he'll be able to because it broke. I don't know if you can see this in my big fat fingers. It broke right at the tip. It's such a pretty hook. See that? I think that, that it broke right at the tip. He's going to try. I have the bit, but... I'm not getting anything that small again. Nothing less than an H hook in the in the um, resin because it's just too fragile. Um, I of course I cannot remember any of the names. This one's an I. I got this for Christmas. My dad got it for me. And that was the only, the first one that was bought for me. I bought the G one. This one's a J. And this is what they replaced my G one with. They said we will replace it with any variety and any size you want except Pride. So, and that was before they had the Polaris. So they probably wouldn't have replaced it with the Polaris because it's new. I believe this is um, Andromeda? No, I don't know. I really have no idea, but that's a J. I really love the feel of these and the sparkle. I really should write the name on all the boxes. I wrote the size on the boxes because no one's going to get these but me. Uh, this one's an H. And this one's Aries. I know it because someone told me... <laughs> And red, I should know. I should know Aries is red. So there's H. I hope you're seeing the sparkle. I bought this one too. I bought two of them. Was gifted one of them of the of the resin ones. And then I won this one on Lisa Ladybird. It's my only Odyssey, and this is an I. And I really enjoyed this one, too. I don't have a problem with weight in my hand. So that's good. And those are all my furls. Which are quite a bit of them. Yeah, there's quite a few of them. And that's my furls box. And then, yes, this is a pencil case off of Amazon. But someone said, you know, pencil cases are great. And they really are. See? Okay. So this is a set of knockoff clovers. But they work really well. No, that's the set of real clovers. Also bought on sale. So that's a set of real clovers that goes from B to J. Ugh. I have one set of clovers. Works really well. Smooth. Love them. Great grip. Um, this, if anybody knows, is Gromit. I actually bought a copy of Crochet Now, I believe it is, which is the UK magazine. And a back issue that had Wallace and Gromit patterns in it and these as the free gift. I bought it and had it sent to me just to get these hooks. This is a four millimeter and the Wallace one is a five millimeter. I needed these hooks. I'm a huge fan. Had to have them. Pattern? Meh. I have the magazine, but the hooks I had to have. 
So, uh, yeah, they actually crochet really well. Um, this one's getting a little loose in the thing, and when it when it finally falls out, my dad will shoe goo it back in. He's found that shoe goo works really well for the hooks. He's had to put a few hooks back in their handles for me. Okay, so these are the knockoff clovers, and they're pointy. They are taper. Um, the grips are actually pretty good. They work. I got them on Amazon. They actually work pretty good. They're smooth. Um, let's see. The clover ones are actually in line, but these are taper. So they're not that great as far as knockoffs. They're a different style altogether. But um, I think I got them on Amazon. And they're not that bad. If you want something cheap, they go from two millimeter to six millimeter, which would be a J. So I don't know how many are in there. Three, at least seven, because I'm missing some in the middle. And then something that I absolutely love are these last ones. They are not all Susan Bates. Some have no name are these wooden handle ones. Let me get that out of the shade. Okay. So, some of them are Susan Bates, and some of them have no name. The Susan Bates ones are in line, and the no name ones are taper, which is weird. But I have a G, an I, a J, a K, an M and an N. And you know what? I love them. I love the wood handle. I'm trying to convince my dad that this would be a great thing for him to make in his wood workshop. Or these wood handle ones. Because I have so many aluminum hooks. If I cannot figure out clay hooks or acrylic ones. Um, these wood ones would sell. You know, and he wouldn't have to sell them for much. Because I already have the aluminum hooks. We could just make a bunch. You know. And he'd just have to make smooth handles. But uh, we'll see. If we ever get the workshop. And then see I have room for more. And room for more. And a pocket. And yeah. And I think this case was only like $17. And it's holding so many of my hooks. But, um, yeah, I even have, what do I have? I have some more large size ergonomic hooks in my thing. I have, I won this in a crochet along. We made a giant, um, let me show you. We made a giant snake out of scraps and... I was randomly picked as the entrance to get this hook. It is, I believe, an eye hook. Where is the mark? Yeah, there's the marking on the back. It's an eye hook. I haven't crocheted with it much because it's a little weird in my hand and I never got used to it. And it's very short here. So it's more of a novelty hook. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'll give it away. Tell me in the um, in the comments if you'd be interested in a hook like this. I mean, since it is so short here, would anybody work with a hook this short? Tell me. Let me know. But, um, yeah. Anyway, those are some, those are all my hooks pretty much. And uh, I showed you my favorites and kind of told you why. And let me know about your favorite hooks. This is a very long video for me. I hope you have a wonderful day. And uh, I hope it's cool where you are. It's a bit warm here. But it's not hot. So that is nice. And there's a nice breeze. I hope you have yarn and time to use it in your day.